Okay, HP is now in its 11th year. Uh, it was designed as an initiative to uh, invigorate, reinvigorate uh, the study of the humanities uh, in Africa. Uh, we are proud to have um, uh, over 400 fellows, uh, people who, scholars, African scholars who have received uh, research support. Uh, we also have over 100 senior scholars who have served as our assessors. And so it's a community of 500 people. Uh, it's still growing. Uh, we look forward to another three years of activity, uh, two more fellowship competitions. Why humanities? We are all humans. Uh, the humanities study uh, what makes us humans. Uh, our history, our culture, our um, relations with each other, uh, our languages, uh, our literature, uh, the uh, political scientists like to say uh, that uh, people have a natural propensity to truck, barter, and exchange. Humanities say people have a natural tendency to tell stories. Uh, and it's through their stories that they communicate, and that's what we study. Well, the, we, we have been discussing the trends in, in scholarship. Uh, so the trends that we talked about yesterday are research on women in the humanities in Africa. Uh, and that produced a uh, very active discussion um, at every one of these regional assemblies. We would talk uh, um, about another uh, trend. We might talk about religion and religious responses uh, to society's problems at the next one. Um, so that's one thing, to look at the research that has been produced. Another thing is the organization. So. Uh, the community, uh, the AHP community, is now in the process of self-organizing. So to take charge of um, uh, the residencies, the mentoring uh, opportunities, uh, because sooner or later the funder is going to conclude funding, and we want to be uh, the community to be healthy enough uh, to be able to continue the activities on its own.